Hello and welcome to Everdream Valley where we are once again slept for more than 12 hours and um, we need to make the chicken purchase. So how was it that we made them again? Um, Animal friend achievement. Um, there was supposed to be like a workshop somewhere. Can't apparently pick those up. Hmm, okay. Let's pick that up though. And, um, these, I guess. We'll do a little bit of cleaning here while we search for um, that workshop. A lot of stuff to clean up here though. Hmm, wonder who's been partying here while uh, grandma and grandpa have been away. So, he, oh, it's, it was, it was Jay for quests, wasn't it? Yeah, right. Um, it just says to build purchase at the workshop and it's the green icon on the map. So, do we see a green icon anywhere? We've got a white one. Also, is that willow we see on the map there? <laughs> the cow? Hmm, I guess we go for the white icon. Is that like a hammer under the icon? Indicating that it is the workshop? Maybe. Let's go see. Also, Grandpa, what's up? Oh yeah, the uh, stuff you've collected. Mushrooms and a primrose. Yeah, I guess we didn't pick up all that much stuff yesterday. So, is this it? Yeah, we just need to fix it. And um, we can start crafting. But I would like to kind of um, clear away these first. go and now we do the crafting thing so we already have the boards now we just need more hay um I guess we need to go and find hay 
also pick some of these things up while um while we're here hey oh there's loads of hay in here wonder if that's just a decoration thing or if it's actually usable I guess we'll find out okay seems to be usable so is there any point to uh, cleaning this place up Oh, we could put the stuff in the storage. That'd be a bit neater than just having it lying around like this. I wonder if there's any use for all the crates and things that we just picked up. The garden hoses we can probably use. Oh yeah, shift click to transfer to the chest. Mm, and once we get the cow, I imagine we'll be able to use the milk jugs too. Milk canisters as well, maybe? There we go. I think that's all we want to put away for now. Now, let's make a chicken perch. We needed to make three of these, didn't we? Hmm. We'll need more boards. Well, no way to craft them, so I guess we'll just have to find them. Let's look around. See if we can find more boards. So we just crafted what? Oh, there's boards. So we just crafted um, one perch. So we need to craft two more. So ten more boards altogether. Um, let me see if I can pick that up. Nice. One, two, three, four, five. And there was one behind me as well. But, um. Oh. Mm, there's five more right there. But I guess, um. <laughs> As I was playing, I was focused on other things and didn't notice. So, um, we'll come back to those in just a bit. It's useful to look around and uh, pick up whatever other stuff we find as well, so... It's not like this is going to go to waste or anything. Hmm. Looks like there's a clothes washing place there. Seemed to be just decorative, at least for now. Didn't look like we could use it. Oh yeah, there's the watering can. And a bucket and a bottle. Well, two bottles, actually. 
maybe we should put the watering can into our hot bar as well. Oh, right, you need to drag it into the hot bar. Okay. I wonder when we'll get to do some um some gardening or like a uh, like growing of crops. We could probably do some of that already, but we haven't really had a quest for it, have we? So I'm I'm kind of um waiting for that. Um doing things in the order that the the game tells us to do them. All right. Two more, two more chicken perches coming up. There we go. Now what? Do we just place them or um Hmm, there are no markers on the map now for this quest. Yep, we just place them near the chicken coop. Oh, I started going the wrong way, didn't I? Yep. The chickens are over here. I may want to clean this environment up a little first though, before I place down the perches. Yeah, let's pick up all of this trash. A huge pile of trash here. Jeez. Can't be good for the animals. Alright. Uh, maybe we want to clear these away too. Oh yeah, we could move the chicken, chicken house was it, if we wanted to. So do we just pick these up and, yep, we just pick these up and place them. We can rotate them if we want to, but I mean they are just a uh, square perches like that. I don't think there's any like a uh, significance as to which way they're facing all the sides seem to be the same um although the chickens kind of went into them with their backs to us does that mean that there is like a front side on i don't know None of the sides look different to me. Oh well. Um... Now what? We don't have anything for us on the map. Do we need to talk to Grandma or Grandpa? Tell them that, that we did the chicken perch thing? No. Grandpa? Anything? No.
Okay, so I guess we just um try to find Willow. Let's equip the bell. Oh, right. I I guess do we need to put it in the no, we have it equipped. Um maple we can just pet you, but we can't do anything with the bell, though. Um, do we need to have it on the hot bar? No. It just says to show Willow's Bell to the dog. Hmm. No other hints as to what to do. Uh, the dog did need to be a certain level, didn't it? Do we need to throw more sticks? Get it leveled up more? This doesn't seem to be doing anything, does it? I guess, does the uh, tassel hat there kind of indicate the dog's level and it's already at max level? And that's why it always says the dog's level has risen. Because it's already at max and it, it, it can't rise anymore. Hmm. So, are you like already on Willow's trail or something? Do we just need to follow you? Maybe? No. No. It's just, uh, running around. do this then oh that's right the treats aha and now we hold the bell okay so now you're uh, on Willow's trail and we need to follow you? Okay, okay. I'm learning. Oh. 
Are we going to the cow that was on the map? Or is it some other cow? Yeah, yeah. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hmm. I don't know if this was the cow on the map. Well, apparently this is Willow. And now we just gotta pet it to get it to follow us. It just needs to hold still for long enough for us to hold the E button or long enough to actually start petting it. There we go. Okay, Willow, just uh, follow me, all right? Gotta make sure to not go too fast. Willow, making sure that um, it does indeed follow us all the way back home. Alright, find Willow quest complete and we can now buy a white down jacket from the merchant. I guess this could be Willow's enclosure. wood in order to be able to fix it though. Well, hopefully Willow stays in here. Yeah, all the chickens are facing away from us. Hmm. There's feathers. What a nice feather. I wonder who it belonged to. Yeah, this does not look like it came from one of these chickens. Interesting. Willow didn't stay in her enclosure. Okay, well, at least she's on the farm now. Grandpa? Do you happen to know what this feather is? Let me take a look at it. Yes, it looks like it belonged to a rooster. We used to have one on the farm. They are very useful birds. You can try and find it and bring it back to the farm. How do you go about it? Your best bet is to enlist the help of a dog. Let him smell the feather. It should pick up the trail and lead you to the bird. Willow is already at the farm. Bravo! 
I expected nothing less from you. Now we need to fix her, fix her enclosure so she doesn't go on such long walks again. Please, take these diagrams. You will build fences and gates using the workshop in front of the barn. Build an enclosed pen with fences and gates. Inside the enclosure, place a plaque with the name of the animal. There can be different placards in one enclosure. You can combine different types of fences with each other. Okay? We already have an enclosure. That looks kind of nice. We just need to fix up the fences in there. So I guess let's get to it and uh, chop down some trees. Get us a bunch of wood so that we can fix all the gaps. I guess while we're at it we can get rid of these. What a strange bog. Oh, is that something we need to ask Grandma or Grandpa about? Hmm, let's see here. <gasps> oh, that was one of the fruit trees I'd... Oh. I didn't realize those were part of the orchard as well. Well, now we have two cherry trees instead of three. It's fine. I'll be more careful in the future. I guess that's some wood, maybe enough to fix all the gaps. It didn't seem to take very much wood to fix one gap. Let's see. There's two more gaps to fix. One more here. Yeah, why not use the uh, existing enclosure? This way we don't have to build our own. Oh, there was a gap right there. I guess I'd want to get rid of that, um, little tree there. Oh, it was two little three, little trees. And we'll fix that. And there's another gap. Maple. I guess that's all fixed up now. We'll leave the gate here open and hope we get a willow to go in there. Do we need to craft the plaque? No, we don't seem to be able to. Huh. It just says to put the cow sign inside. So do we already have it in our inventory? Hmm. 
This is a very big enclosure, though. Uh, well, for now, we're not exactly lacking in space. And it did say we can have several plaques in the same enclosure. So, it's fine. Now, where do we want to put this? Do we just uh, put all the plaques kind of in the middle? Or off to the side? Hmm. Maybe sort of middle-ish. Like right here. And now, now we can buy more from the merchant. Okay. Uh, Willow? There you are. You're going into the barn. Well, um, we actually have an enclosure for you. Just gotta pet you. Oh, you ate some hay. You were hungry. I guess that didn't really take. Let's get rid of this hay here. <gasps> You're eating all the hay. How hungry are you? Come on. We've got a mirror available now. Congratulations! From now on, you can sell chickens. To sell an animal, chase it or bring it to the vendor's pen. You'll find information about which animals you can already sell on the merchant's cart. You can unlock the ability to sell other animals by completing more story quests. Alright. Cool. Yellow rubber boots are now available. Walk up to a calm animal and pet it. The stroked animal will follow you for 20 seconds. This way, you can guide the animal from one enclosure to another. Alright, Willow. You stay here, okay? Uh, um, um, okay. You're kind of half in and half out. Um... That can't be comfortable for you, but okay. Grandma? Willow is back and healthy. Thank you, sweetie. As soon as I heard that happy mooing, I knew my friend was coming home. I'm not the only one who is grateful. Willow would also like to show you her thanks for giving her peace of mind, albeit in her own bovine way. Animals feel safe in their pens. And when they don't have predators to worry about, they have much more time to focus on activities such as producing milk. Take that jog and milk willow. When you come back to me with the milk, I'll teach you how to make a delicious stew with it. Place the cow in an enclosed enclosure with a cow tag. Use the milk jug on the cow to start the mini game. The cow gives milk every three days if it's not sick or hungry. Okay, well, let's go do this. 
it's after 8 p.m. and uh, Willow did seem to be asleep. <laughs> Quite uncomfortably there. But, um, how do we do this? Um, oh, okay, cool. Or we can just skip the mini game altogether by pressing E. Well, I mean, it's it's not a bad mini game. Not especially interesting or anything, but not bad either. I have the milk, Grandma. Bravo! You can make many delicious dishes with milk. For example, a delicious vegetable stew. The food you cook can be sold or eaten, which will raise your stamina for a while. But before we get to cooking, I would like you to get some ingredients for me and fix the kitchen. Okay, well we've already fixed <gasps> inventory extension. Interesting. We'll have to take a look at that. Collect three different vegetables. I think we have three different ones growing in the garden. But we'll continue from here in the next episode. So thank you so much for spending time with me here on the Mellow. It was lovely to have you. Please remember to be kind to yourself. Have a lovely rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.